for the sake of time I'm just going to show you what a three-point perspective looks like it has this kind of feel to it notice the three points to the right to the left and the third one is straight down so that means none of the edges are truly perpendicular they're all guide to a vanishing point actually the way I created this is uh, by drawing one segment I did create one edge perpendicular horizon so by creating the perpendicular through the vanishing point that'll create this edge and then from these two randomly placed points on there that segment we can draw to all the vanishing points the last part of the lesson is to actually find vanishing points in famous works of art so using these buttons down here we can click on one such as the Annunciation and we're trying to find where this picture is sort of drawn towards that creates the depth so any edge any straight edge is going to give you a clue like these edges all go towards something these edges are all moving excuse me just a second this edge is all moving actually it looks like this edge is going parallel to the whole picture or across the frame but these edges create depth and so do these and so do these so using sketchpad how can we find a little more accurately use the line tool so using the line tool we can click and drag and this is just now approximation but by dragging along these edges we can get a sense of where it might be we draw along these edges as well and any edge that's going into the picture now notice all of mine do not meet because I've randomly placed these lines so there's a little bit of guesswork and you may want to go back and try to adjust them use a color that stands out from the drawing and then you're gonna see approximately although the artist who was da Vinci and uh, actually da Vinci's teacher they were all I had a part in this da Vinci just finished this painting he didn't create the whole subject matter and you'll see by experimenting with you know approximately where these edges might go that the vanishing point is somewhere off into the horizon towards this mountainous area a better question might be why so with this idea of using the line tool can you approximate where the vanishing point is on all of these such as the Last Supper or the Feast of Heroid or Paris a rainy day or the miracle of the believing donkey one of the earlier works of a vanishing point and then you create one on your own and that will be the lesson